Hey, how are you doing, trader? How, how's things going? I'm back. I'm come to hand in my missions. Oh, I like this. Look at that. I have speakers like this. Well, very similar. Multimedia speakers. Clear audio, right? But you know what's crazy about these speakers? I got the Logitech speakers that are like this. I've got I had the older version and then I decided to upgrade to the newer version. And the newer version is worse than the older version. Yeah, no kidding. I was kind of disappointed in that. I was like, my goodness, why? You would think the newer one would sound better. No? No. I don't know. Welcome back, guys. We're doing that series again called The Contractor. Basically, we're going to go around doing some missions. And that's all we're going to be doing. We can craft on ourselves, but uh, I'm not going to be doing like workbenches, bases, and things like that. We're just going to go ahead and, and do a bunch of missions. Oh, hang on a second. Let me just put that and get my health up. I need to get some, I think, vitamins will help the fatigue. There you go. And uh, I think we need painkillers for that. And I think we can try and buy. But let's hand in this mission quickly. The two times scope. Uh, I'll take the two times scope so I can sell it. I really do not like the two times scope in this game. And then let's clear up some of our stuff. We won't need a, a wrench. Let's get rid of that. Let's sell that. So we clear up our bags. And then we're going to go ahead and do some more missions. Uh, let's see. What else do don't we We don't really need iron. Uh, we don't really need that. We can get that easy. Glass, we don't need. The blackstrap coffee, I might want to keep. Get rid of the beer. Uh, the main reason why I actually get rid of the beer is that, like, it makes my screen all fuzzy and I don't like it. It sucks. It really sucks. Okay, let's see. Uh, medical. Okay, it doesn't have any painkillers, which is fine. Uh, the rest we can just throw away if we need to do so, so we are good. A question. Jobs. What do you have for me? We all, we've only got tier 1 still. So, let's grab uh, this one. Let's make sure we haven't done it before. Uh, Faber's, Faber's house. We're going to Faber's house. Very nice. I hope he's welcoming. Let's go say hello to Faber. Right, so I am enjoying this, guys. This is pretty fun. It's nice. Uh, I like the fact that I don't have to worry too much about building and, and concentrating on my inventory and whatnot. It's kind of annoying. Uh, I've added a, a, a mod to this, by the way, so we, we've got a mod running, it's a Reach Gaming mod, it's the custom kill count. So, on the right hand side of my screen, when I kill a zombie, you'll see what shows up. I'm kind of giving it a test, because it's kind of a new mod. And then we'll see how it works out, because it's still new and whatnot. You can download the mod if you want to, just uh, go to my website, www.reachgaming.net. And you can download our launcher, which is a Reach, reach launcher. And you should be able to get that mod on there. It's called the Reach Kill Count, something like that. Okay. So he has Faber's house. Faber's got a wonderful house. Look at him go. All up and all that green. I love it. Faber, you got a nice green house. We can be friends in real life. I love the color green. So we're good. Okay. Uh, let's drink that a bit. Let's have some food. Let's get rid of this ugly thing. Here you go. Okay. Let's get this going. I've got no ammo, by the way, which is very bad. I've got some some arrows. The problem with these POIs is this is like double the zombies. That's a problem. <laughs> these things, they, they alert you of the zombies. We'll try and get a, a, a sneak attack here. Let's see what we can do. Uh, the problem with the custom POI is sometimes, I don't know if it happens in single player, but sometimes it, uh, the zombies take a long time to spawn. I'm kind of worried about the fact that they're... I think I have woken up a zombie. I heard a sound. Was that me? There you go. There's a zombie there. Nice. So that kill count on the right, I think it's too fast. I, I could barely see that. So yeah, we're going to do some tests with it today. Let's grab that. Uh, can I sell that? I can sell that in the arrows. I'll take that as well. Um, take, give my arrow back, man. Thank you. Can't keep them arrows. Uh, oh, that's a pain. I hate that. I really got to find some... Uh... Oh, I've definitely woken up something. One is awake. You're awake! Oh! Okay, I've woken up more because I stood up. Okay. Another one died. Okay, looks like we're going all out. Oh man, I hate this bow. Bring it on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's rumble. 
I'm not scared of you, I got a couch, so we're fine. Okay, couch. Couch. Ah! <laughs> oh crap, hi! Oh, there's so many zombies on this POI! That's the problem with these custom POIs, there's so many of them. Oh man. <laughs> okay, relax. And yeah, of course. Guys, I hate this pose so much. Oh. If I'm playing on a server, it's a little bit better because uh, it's, it's a slight amount of lag. So it's not so bad. I can dodge and weave the zombies. Okay, another one down. Another one down. Okay. Okay, we got a zombie at the door. Let's get arrows back. We'll get better at this as we go. I hope so. <laughs> okay. Where did you come from? You're just an outside zombie? Just a Roma? Is that it? Really? Okay. Hey, I'm not moaning. Uh, the brass, we could sell that. So the majority of things I'm gonna sell, because it's just like, I, I make money from it, so why not? Let's grab that. Bandage. Very nice. And then, of course, please get some ammunition. Ugh. Just take and sell. This is not a bad POI. It's a, it's a very standard POI, nothing too special about it. I like the underneath little section. A lot, a lot of the older houses in South Africa, right? Uh, they've got a lot of these underground sections like this. And I remember when I was a kid, right? I, I would always love to go under there. It was all, it would always be super scary for me. But I, I would always go under there. It was kind of fun. And I was always worried about snakes, right? Being underneath there, but I, I never ever saw a snake under there, so I don't know why I was so worried. Uh, right, let's just scrap that. What's this do? Cooling mesh. I'll take that. Yeah, so I remember that, but underneath the, the houses here, it's just like sand, right? There's no plants or anything. It's just like all sand. It would be such a, like, a cool place to, like, go underneath. It's like, wow, this is, like, so foreign to be under your house. It's like, it was so much fun, actually. My, my, my dad would get so angry every time I would go underneath there, though. I'm not sure why. Okay. Uh, I think... I still gotta get my... Where is that? Am I done? Wow, okay. I'm done. I picked it up. Nice. Okay. Uh... Where does this go? Zombie? Hi! Uh... I don't really want to go and do that. We need to try and uh, get out of here. That's gonna take me forever. I think it goes outside, actually. We'll take a look now. Yeah, but it's not a bad POI, so... Good job. Whoever did it. Not too bad. It could use some more detail, though, for sure. Some books in the corner here. Uh, oh, a recipe. I'll learn it anyway. There's a lot of stuff that I've missed. I'm trying to grab that all. But remember, guys, it's not a big deal if I miss anything, because it's like... I don't really need much loot. All I need is, like, ammunition, and that's, like, the main thing. Like, like glue, for instance. That... Ah, uh, it might come in handy, because remember, I can craft things on me. Okay, let's... Grab that. Oh, no, iron crossbow bolt. We don't need that. Okay, no, we don't need that. Right. Okay, there's an arrow. Yeah, look at that. It's all my, all my bad, all my bad aim. Okay. I was thinking maybe we should try and like introduce a mod where I get thirsty and hungry more often. That way, the food, it, it makes sense to have lots of food and whatnot, or keep finding food or something. I always felt that. The hunger and thirst in this game is so bad. It's like you don't ever really need to worry too much. And even when you like starve and stuff in this game, it's not a big deal really. Because it's like, you know, well, you're not gonna die so straight away. It's take a while for you to die. The zombies just chilling in the garden here, hey. Enemy killed. Okay. That's the thing with the custom POIs, right? This is another custom one. Uh, you got just zombies just chilling randomly in the in the gardens and whatnot. You gotta kind of be careful walking around the gardens. There's a dog like just chilling in the corner as well. Let's see if I can get a first shot. Nope, of course not. So I mean, how many times have I walked and oh come on? <laughs> there you go, dog killed. How many times I've, I've just walked like this POI, for instance? I'm pretty certain there are zombies that spawn, like in the garden of it. Gotta be so careful. Okay, I got some more stuff for you. I see your speaker's still available. It's probably the one I bought. No one likes it, guys. 
Uh, art of mining. No, we won't need that. So, uh, let's do some more selling, and then we'll grab another mission and we're going to do it. Okay, so I, I bought some rounds for the shotgun. Uh, for emergencies, and I bought some rounds for the pistol. Emergencies, of course. And then uh, we'll grab another mission here. What are we gonna I'm, I'm gonna try and not do the buried supplies because that's nothing special. We know what that's gonna be, but it feels like I'm I'm running out of stuff here. So, uh, no wait, this is Faber's house again. Okay, hang on a second. I'm grateful for everything. I think it's gonna be slightly. Oh, it's up that side. Okay, let's do that. I don't think it's the same place. I think that Faber's thing is just the person who made it. So that's fine. We'll go and do that. It's gonna do Faber's creation. Faber's house. Let's go see Faber. <laughs> <laughs> That's one name. Uh, wait, there's a car here. Yeah, I want to loot this car. Sometimes cars drop like axes and things. Uh, oh, okay. That's not too bad. We'll grab that. So, guys, if you're wondering what the point of this series is, it's just simply to explore the custom POIs. That's what it's about. And uh, it's it's a lot of fun. I really enjoy the custom POIs. I've just never really gotten a, a chance to... Oh, I'm walking across one of those POIs. That, oh, my goodness. That sounds terrible. Oh... Freaking snake. Oh, I got the chills. <laughs> Imagine falling in there. Hi. She seems very confused to the point where she doesn't know how to get out of there. Hang on a sec. Let me help her out. Hang on. There you go. And the snake as well. I'm not going to harvest the snake. I'm trying to kill it. There you go. So I've been watching a lot of Fear the Walking Dead, by the way. I've, I've finished the Walking Dead series, if you guys have not finished that, uh, I'm not going to spoil anything, but I have finished the Walking Dead series. And I must admit, the uh, the ending was okay, and it was, it was, I think it was, it was fine, it was okay. But the Walking Dead series, like, the last few seasons have been very boring. It's like, one of the worst series, especially at the, at the very end. I think, you know when Rick left the show, right? I think that's when it just... For me, wasn't interesting anymore. Rick is my favorite character, so there's no point of watching it after that. But I finished it, and then I hopped on to the uh, the Fear the Walking Dead. I'm not gonna lie, the first, I think the first two, three seasons of Fear the Walking Dead were boring. Uh, but after that, the Fear the Walking Dead is by far my favorite Walking Dead so far. I I think it was, especially now with the later seasons, especially with the last season, in fact. It's just, it, it, it's amazing. I love it. I, I love what they've done with that. If you guys haven't watched it, you must definitely do it. It's just so exciting, and there's always something new, you know, right? It's like, every story's, like, different and exciting. It's just like, the, with The Walking Dead, it was always like, oh, there's a guy, and he's got a lot of group of people that he's, he's scary, right? You know, like the governor, Negan, and whatnot. But with Fear the Walking Dead, they take it a bit, a step further. They're quite creative with it. I like it. Uh, so all these guys, all these POIs, are all custom POIs. That one's custom. That one's custom. So these ones I can I can tell, right? So with the fun pimps POIs, there's a lot of more lot more detail on the outside, They're like broken and whatnot. Uh, these are too clean looking. You know what I mean? So like for instance, the fun pimps. Uh, they would make something very similar to like this, for instance. That looks a little bit more fun, Pimp. Uh, but that's still custom. All of these are custom. I haven't actually seen any vanilla ones. Damn it! Stop making me miss the shot, zombie! It's all your fault, not my fault. It's not my fault that I suck at the aiming. There you go. Right, well, this is the spirit wire is a little bit further than I, I want it. Oh my goodness gracious guys <laughs> I'm definitely gonna perk up into the archery guys just simply because that is gonna be one of the best things to use around here okay so when we look at the uh, stuff here I'm gonna try and go into uh, boomstick right we're gonna do that because I got a shotgun and then also the pistols so gunslinger we're gonna do that as well and then the archery, and then cardio, uh, pain tolerance, and things like that. Because these POIs, guys, it's just going to get harder and harder and harder. Especially with the next tier, which is tier 2. They just get so much, much more harder. Timber Johnny. I've got to go Timber Johnny. And I think 
I don't see any of the very big POIs here. This one actually looks kind of challenging, isn't it? Some zombies have just spawned on the outside. Look at that. Let me quickly kill him quickly. There you go. That was a pretty good shot, not gonna lie. Oh no, I thought it was that POI. It's not. It's It could be the one around the back. Let's see. You can see the zombies. They spawn quite soon, right? So it's kind of scary. It's not a zombie. They don't worry about him. It's the one in the back, yeah. It's the cheese looking house. <laughs> That's the cheesy one. What is this place? What is this? It's a Shamwe Foods. Okay. Is it the Shamway Foods? Why is it start like there? It's so strange how this thing starts. Where, where do we start this POI? Uh, I don't really like this one. Looks a bit funny. Looks a bit funky. Right, let's see. I think uh, we go up the side. Oh, jeez. What's happened in here? <laughs> that looks horrible. Okay, let's uh, give that a loot. Uh, some more vitamins. Can never go wrong with those. Let's go up here. Ooh. I think this is the way we need to go, right? I feel like this is the way we need to go. It feels like they're kind of pointing me in this direction. There's so many bird nests up here. Look at this. Uh, I actually want to loot these because I'm going to make some arrows in the future. Having bird nests is going to be super handy. Uh, I just hear a lot of zombies downstairs. Can they get up here? Yes, there is a way. Ah. Uh, what is this? Why is this dead end like this? A cooler. Oh, hi. Uh, they're gonna break through that really quickly. Okay. There's so many people. There's so many zombies in here. Come on. Oh, they can't get through there. Okay. Oh, oh, you can, you sneaky boy. There you go. There's a lot of zombies. If I had like a Molotov, man, that'll be so awesome. We need to try and make some Molotovs. Sneaky boys. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> Scare me. Uh, it's nice and close as close quarters, which makes it easier to use the, the bow. This guy's a problem. Fatty, how do you fit through this staircase like that, man? You've been eating too many burgers, my friend. Too many burgers and no exercise. That's very bad for you. Yeah. Horrible. You need some cardio, man. So where's the fat guy who gets eaten first in the zombie apocalypse? My friend, Bronson. <laughs> As you guys have seen him in the channel before if you've been following me a long time. <laughs> uh, he's quite large, especially. Uh, he's, I think he's got a lot thinner now, but like back in the past. He'd, he would always joke, right? That if there was a zombie apocalypse, he would be the first one to get eaten because he's the fat guy. <laughs> And I would run away and leave him behind. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> oh, come on! You're not supposed to be... You're not supposed to be walking around, zombie. You're supposed to be keeping still. So then I can go and kill you. Ooh! Head came right off there. Absolutely awesome. Okay, this is a lot of loot to be looting here. There's so much. So, like, now, this POI needs a lot of work. I, I think it's very cluttered. I have no idea what's going on. It's a bit strange. It's not too bad, actually, now if you look at it like this, but, uh... So, some POIs are just... are like this, and they're quite obvious that it's a custom POI. I'm not gonna break that. Uh, we can try break this. Press and gas. I don't know what we're gonna find here. Uh, oh, repair kits. Yeah, those are gonna be definitely needed because of the fact that, um... See if I can. I need uh, oil, gas, and cloth. That's not hard to get, actually. Yeah, so the repair kits are going to be super nice to get because I can then just fix all my guns and whatnot. That's one thing this game is just abundant of. Repair kits are so abundant. You never have to ever, ever make them. Uh, oh, I'm getting kind of full. How much does that sell for? It's not worth the sell, honestly. Okay. Uh. Shopping carts. There's so many things in here, guys. Look at this. That's another thing with these custom POIs, right? They are so abundant with loot. 
You never have to worry about loot when you looting these things. Let's grab that. Ooh, a sham chowder. Look at that. That is such a nice find. That is free. I hear a zombie. I hear you. You can't be sneaking around like that. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Fun pimps. Why is the glass so see-through? It's like... It's like the... Oh! It's like the time where... When I, my cleaner comes over and she cleans the, 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 the sliding doors and stuff. And you're like, oh wow, the sliding doors open and you just like go run into it nose first. Yeah. Obviously we all learned that the hard way. If you've got a sliding glass door. I think these are arcade machines. Oh, there you go. Uh, a pistol, which we don't need. A uh, blurry berry par, which we can munch on. I am quite full on things at the moment. Uh, I think we, yeah, we're wearing something. We don't need that. We're too cool for that. Uh, can we wear that? No. What I'm wearing is currently better. Please, I need some painkillers, man. Rub some bum cream on. Yeah, we call that bum cream, guys. It's not aloe. What, what is it called? Aloe cream is called bum cream, right? That's what it's called. I think I'm done yet, guys. And I've got, like, no space to take anything more. I'm pretty sure there's more hidden stuff, especially with this POI. Pretty sure there's some more hidden stuff around here. Okay. Here you go. It's a Shamway Foods place. Not bad. Uh, there's a piggy over there. Okay, let's head back and uh, hand this mission in quickly. Okay, I'm, I'm back. Survived. No problems. And by the way, guys, I haven't died yet, right? So my, you can see there. <laughs> no deaths, okay? I'm not trying to trick you. Don't worry. And again, I'm not playing on easy here. It, it is definitely quite challenging. Thank you, sir. Okay, so... Molotovs! Yes! I love you, man! I was gonna make them, but... Uh, yeah. Given is better, right? Okay, guys. So... This is the end of this episode. Uh, it is 26 or so minutes in. I appreciate you guys watching. I am enjoying going through these POIs with you guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. If you are enjoying this series, let me know down below. Uh, your comments are very much appreciated, guys. Every time I read your comments, it's super nice to, to see you guys enjoying stuff. It means a lot to me. It helps the YouTube algorithm. It's just generally a great thing, and thank you guys so much for being part of the channel blood, and everything. I really appreciate it, guys. I'll check you guys around. Bye-bye, everybody.